Interested in mastering motion tracking with CapCut PC? In this tutorial, I will guide you through a process of performing motion tracking using CapCut PC. Motion tracking is a valuable technique in the realm of video editing, allowing you to accurately follow the movement of an object. With motion tracking, you can effortlessly affix text or graphics to objects in motion. So let's dive into this video. I'll demonstrate how to perform motion tracking on a person running. We'll start with adding text to the video, ensuring it spans in the entire duration. So for the text itself, I'll simply write subscribe and we'll customize the size and font type. To enhance its appearance, we can also apply templates. So we have a flexibility to position the text anywhere we desire. So in this instance, I'll just place it above the person. Once the text is selected, navigate the tracking tab and click on the motion tracking icon. A yellow box will appear, moving it to cover the moving object we wish to track, so in this case, the running person. Ensure that the object remains consistently visible to prevent tracking issues. So you can track various elements in your video. So there's a nifty tool that lets you adjust the box's corners to be rounded when you pull it on it. So additionally, you can rotate the box to align it better with your target. Feel free to adjust these settings as needed. For more precise results, set the direction to both although this may increase calculation time. So if you want the text to maintain a constant size throughout the video, disable the scale option. Similarly, you can turn off the distance option to maintain a specific distance. These settings are flexible. It can be tailored to your preference. Now, click start to initiate the calculation. Simply wait for CopCut to begin tracking. As you can observe, CopCut smoothly tracks the person and keeps the text in sync with the movements. So this method works for tracking various objects. Just enclose your target within the yellow box and CopCut will do the rest. So okay, the process is finished. Let me go ahead and play the video to show you how it looks. So as you can observe, the text is smoothly following the person's movement and it's looking great. Now, let's shift our focus to the motion tracking using the image or photo. To begin, we'll make some adjustments to the image, resizing it to a smaller size and positioning it behind the person. Feel free to fine-tune its placement to achieve the desired look. Once satisfied with the image placement, you can now begin the motion tracking process. Ensure that the image is selected. Navigate to the tracking tab and click on the motion tracking icon. Adjust the yellow tracking box to encompass the person inside it. Then click start to initiate the calculation. Simply wait for the tracking to complete. And as you can see, CopCut tracks the person and moves the image along with it. And it's done. Now let's play the video. And you can see how the image seamlessly moves in sync with the person. And it looks perfect. So if you wish to break the connection between the text and the object, just simply select none. And then the text will no longer follow the object's movements. And that's it. And that is how motion tracking is done in CopCut PC. I hope you liked it. And if you have any questions or confusion, comment down below and I will respond to each and every question as soon as possible. I hope this video helped you. And please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel and turn on that notification bell to keep you updated. Thank you for watching.